What up, Naturalista Beauties? It's Kiana coming at you with a quick video on how I kind of revive, if you will, this old ass twist out that I've had in my hair about seven days. Don't judge me, today is wash day. But because I have some errands to run, this gonna have to do what it do. And if you see if I turn around, it look like I got on a damn hat. Oh, I can't stand it. But <laughs> look at this shit. But anywho, I'm gonna go ahead and more than likely throw it up in an updo. I don't know what I want to do with it yet. So I just thought that I'd bring you guys along with me on trying to figure out how to style this. It's more than likely gonna be definitely in an updo. Maybe in my hand, a little bit hanging or something like that in the front. I don't know what I want to do, but hey, wherever the wind take me, that's where I'm gonna go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get started and obviously I'm gonna use my staple products. And if you've been rolling with me for a while, you know exactly which ones I'm talking about. I'm talking about my Quench Curl Refresher by Made Beautiful. And I'm talking about my Shea Yogurt just for moisturizing. I don't want to put too much product on my hair. I'm literally going to use just these two with the exception of maybe an edge control if my edge is going to be poking out. You know what I'm saying? I might want to kind of slick it down or whatever. And I'm going to use this blueberry control paste. So I don't know whether or not I'm going to take. It just depends. It just depends. I don't know whether or not I want to use this small ouch list or this large one to kind of put in a puff number, but I seriously doubt I want to do a puff. I might want to kind of just like, you know, jazz it up. Get it together, girl. Get it together. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and just spritz my hair real quick. Get it to the point where it's manageable for me. All right. I think that's good enough. Yeah. Uh, maybe let me put some in this front. Okay, and I'm gonna take my shea yogurt. As much as I talk about this shea yogurt, y'all, y'all would think that I'm an ambassador, but I am not. But girl, Miss Graham, Miss Graham, if you want me to be, <laughs> I will be. <laughs> So I'm gonna just moisturize the top. Obviously the hair that's gonna be exposed. Then I'm gonna go and follow through and put it around, around, around my little edges. Make them moisturize. I don't wanna be too heavy handed with it, but I'm gonna get just another little dollop just to get the edges. I like to show my little edges some love, child. As much trauma as they have been through when I get these protective styles and when I go to these salons, like African salons, unfortunately, I have stopped going to with the exception of one because she a natural hair diva and believe it or not, some of them do take care of your natural hair and she has been taking care of mine. So I'm happy that I found her. Okay. Now that I got that moisturized and it's movable for me. Go ahead and see what I want to do with this. I'm thinking maybe I could put it up in a number like that. Let's see. Let's see y'all. Let's see. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna section off the front right here. And I'm not gonna force my hair apart because I don't want no unnecessary popping. None of that nonsense. No, yeah, I'm gonna pull this up right here. And I think I'm gonna leave about that much out at the front. And then what I'm gonna do, be real gentle when I separate. Cause this is around the time where it pop. I'm gonna take one of my little clips that I typically use. We get these from Sally's child. They got them in there for like a dollar fifty. So clip the front out the way and then I think I'm going to go ahead and start applying some of the edge control because I can see now that my edge is going to be out and y'all I love to wear these little candy curls like on the side so I like to pull those down because I don't want to include them in so let me go ahead and hook it up I don't really take that much just a little bit and I don't like it to really touch this part because I don't like all that gummed up stuff on my hair. All right. 
See what I do, what I do, what I do, what I do. What I do. <laughs> All right. Let's get it around in the back. Y'all really don't like to use gel in my hair because I find that it creates so much product buildup in my hair. So I usually use the edge control, especially this blueberry control place, place paste, because it actually kind of seems like it kind of disintegrates over a while. And then it just kind of serves as a moisturizer, to be honest with you, after a little bit. That's what it feel like for me, at least. Now, I'm not going to say for everybody else. It could have product build up for somebody else because, hey, to each his own when it comes to your hair. But for me, not really a lot. All right. So I'm going to take a brush. Don't come for me. Yes, I'm using the brush because that's what smooths down my edges. Because I told you the roughest part of my hair are these edges, y'all. I think I am gonna take the big one because my hair is so thick today. Super thick. I'm gonna bring it up. And then I'm gonna pull this hair that's clipped up down. Make sure all the other hair is up successfully in this little ouchless pony. I'm gonna drop it. See? Where I dropped it, I probably need to bring it up just a little bit more so it can fall on that part <laughs> or somewhat of that part. And then you see how I got it tighter here around the edges? I'm literally just going to pull it up to the height that I would like. Okay. Girl, you girl need to get in the trim. <sighs> I need to get in the trim like a damn dragon I am. All right, so I fluff, 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 fluff. Make sure that I'm good to go all the way around. Feel like I am. And what I'm going to do is now take this hair out the clip. And let's pray. Pray for the kid that this come out okay, girl. Pray for the kid. Okay. So, what I'm gonna do now is because obviously my hair is hanging a little bit too low for my, my comfort in the front. I'm gonna take these lonely two bobby pins that I got left, y'all. And I'm gonna try to get all of this hair up out my face, out my face. Okay. So, I'm gonna pull it up a little bit to where it sits. I think I'm on it about that high. All right. And there you go. Now I'm pulling. Maybe I need to bring it down a little bit more. Yeah, let me bring that down a little bit more. Trial and error, trial and error. All right, that's down a little bit more. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so I think that's what I'm gonna roll with today, y'all. I ain't trying to be too fancy. I mean, it's. It is what it is. At least I ain't running out here looking like no damn clown. So I think I'm gonna rock it like that. And now last but not least, I'm gonna go ahead and do my little candy curls that I like that I think are so darling. Grab the side here. I'm extra gentle with my little edges. I want them to stay around, you know. <laughs> and I'm going to spray a little bit of the Curl Refresher on my little hands. Just so it can start to revert into a curl. And I like to hold 
right here at the root and then twist real nice and gentle like and there you go i just let it do what it do real nice and gentle because you don't want to pull those out because those are definitely very sensitive on my head and they are prone to popping if i'm not gentle with it so i'm just lightly smoothing the product through okay and then i'm going to spray a little bit of my curl refresher smooth it through massaging that product in hold the root and start to twist so that curl and just help that curl along to revert all right and there we have it y'all quick simple to the point i actually think it look all right i think i did all right <laughs> all right so just so you can kind of get a 360 view of what it looked like i'm gonna kind of turn to the left and turn to the right and turn to the back and there you go all right so guys if you like these quick easy styles when you got somewhere you gotta go hit me up let me know what you want to see like comment subscribe and let's dialogue a little bit all right holla <laughs>